All right, quick video. Uh, obviously, change to this is that I'm using a Heim joint now uh, as a alternator bracket. And they sell these on Amazon. I think this was like 15 bucks. This is the five inch or five and a half inch uh, version. And right now I'm running a 15 460 belt, uh, which was the right uh, length. I tried 15. 450 and that was just too short uh for the five inch heim uh but anyway uh i like it it puts nice tension on the belt uh which yeah nothing too crazy but i was getting slippage when i you know gassed it off uh off of idle and so now it's you know perfectly quiet and you know spins the alternator and the water pump perfectly you're going to need to Either get a spacer or use two nuts, and you're going to need an extended bolt. Uh, and it was the, I believe, M8 times uh, inch and a quarter or something, or uh, times uh, spin was 1.25, and it was a two inch bolt. That'll give you enough length uh, to get in there and, you know, get deep into the alternator. You should be aware, though, that this bolt that goes into the engine block. It does go into the water jacket. So when you pull this, you're going to get a flow of water out. Nothing crazy. It doesn't, you know, shoot out or spray. You're going to want to have a, you know, catch tray ready. Throw the heim joint on one side onto the bolt. It's a long one, and put it right back in and screw it back in. You're, you'll lose, you know, not even a cup of uh, coolant in the interim. Uh, but the nice thing is. Once you get it out to distance, you just put a, you know, adjustable wrench on it and you can tighten or loosen it to two spec. And so you get a sort of a perfect, uh, uh, perfect fit and perfect tension versus trying to hold the alternator with one hand and, and tension it with a screw uh, on the other side. So very easy to, to do, relatively easy to install. Again, just remember you need a spacer or uh, a thick and a skinny nut um, and uh, be aware of this one uh, you know, that there's coolant behind it so otherwise seems to work great I'm using the outer ring uh, to give it more distance but we got plenty of space might have been eh, no it doesn't look like you'd be able to get away with the inside so obviously if you've got a single uh, a single spindle or ring uh, alternator, you're gonna run into trouble, so you need the double. So, uh, pretty easy uh, swap if, if need be. Hope this is helpful.